Isang.
Good evening, people of God. Welcome to our anniversary cantata tonight. We are so grateful to the Lord for indeed He has allowed us to reach 120 years of mission and ministry. We are so thankful in our hearts, in fact, are overflowing with joy and thanksgiving for how God has sustained us all through the years. Welcome once again, and let us sing welcome song to all of us, especially to our guests who are here. Are there guests who are here with us tonight? Oh, our speaker, Ma'am Betty Makan. Welcome to our cantata, Ma'am, and all others who are here. General Louis Purakan is also here. Edna Tom. Hi, Te. Okay, so welcome for tonight's uh, anniversary cantata. Uh, we are also grateful to the Lord for the message we received this morning from our uh, guest preacher, Betty Makan, we thank you, ma'am, for the three pointers, uh, three pointer sermon that has really moved us to be inspired and keep going in the ministry until another 120 years. We will be then part of the history uh, by that time. And we are also extending our thanks to all the participating churches. For our Daig this afternoon, a praise festival through music, we are so grateful to the Lord for sending you here and rejoice with us in the celebration of, of the 120 years of God's goodness and faithfulness. We also would like to, uh, for our concerns, we would also like to announce that tomorrow will be a holiday for well, every one of us, as we will be joining in the uh, barangay election. Uh, so we, uh, and, and on October 31 until November 2, it will be a holiday for all workers of UCCP CCC. So that will be our time to relax, do the laundry, and clean our houses. What are they going to relax? Okay. So, but thank, uh, thank, thank you for that holiday. And we will be back on Friday. Uh, we would also like to extend our birthday greetings to all celebrators this week. If you are here, please raise your hand, as well as those who will be celebrating their wedding anniversary. So we thank God for the gift of life and for the gift of relationship that God has given you as you also continue to make yourselves available for God's use. Okay. Let us now sing greeting song. <laughs> Let us all stand for our call to worship. Shout for joy to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him with joyful songs. Know that the Lord is God. It is he who made us, and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving, and his courts with praise. 
Give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good and his love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through all generations.
church from the crooked road to the crossroads that has been the life journey of uccp crossroads congregational church the journey indeed was full of challenges troubles and tribulations but the assurance of the lord jesus christ stands take heart for i have overcome the world to celebrate and thank him for 120 years of his faithfulness we offer these songs of praise. In 1970, Mam Felicitas de Montaire organized the Junior Choir, whose members became the Visayan Choir. They sang in the 7.30 a.m. service, and in 1974, the Visayan Choir was renamed Bulawanong Pananaw, with Miss Madeline Humawan as their conductor, other conductors have included Miss Grace Tabada, Mr. Rudyard Montaire, Deaconess Joy Veloso, Miss Mahal Oriarte, and today we have Mr. Greg Canceran. Here to render Awit Sakatuigan and Jesu Cristo Magaharika, ladies and gentlemen, we present to you Bulawanong Pananawit.
thank you, Bulawanong Pananawit, for your graceful and beautiful rendition, reminding us of the Lordship of Jesus Christ in our lives and in the life of this church. Our next choir shares most of the same journey as this church, known as the oldest choir in UCCP Davao, the chancel choir traces its roots back to the early 1940s under the directorship of Helen Gem. The baton was turned over to Mr. Francisco Aceoche, and previous directors included Mrs. Teresa Orinario, Mrs. Felicitas Di Bontaire, Professor Ernesto Pareño, Mrs. Macrina Heconcilio, Mr. Rudyard Montaire. Mr. Alvin Bong Aviola, Mr. Dave Fortuna, Mr. Harold Pedida, and Ms. Maria Mahal Oriarte. Brothers and sisters, now, now under the directorship of Ms. Erica Panotes, to sing his enduring mercy and everlasting love and festive praise the chancel choir.
and powerful message. Thank you, Chancel Choir. Praise the Lord indeed for His enduring mercy and everlasting love for us. Our next choir was formed in 1995. It has its roots as Gintong Himig. It is composed mostly of the young people of this church and for the longest time, they sang at the 6 a.m. worship with Mr. Greg Canceran as the conductor. Deaconess Joy Veloso also joined in when she was with the ecclesiastical team, had directed the choir. And now even we do not have the 6 a.m. service, they still continue to sing in our different worship services. Friends, brothers and sisters, with their rendition of Timeless One and to God be the glory, help me welcome our very own Glorious Harmony Choir.
What an impact. We are grateful to the Lord for you, Glorious Harmony Choir. We pray that you'll be timeless in singing for our one and only God. The life and, the life and testament brought about by our choral music is indeed one of the most defining identities of our congregational church. For our next rendition, it started out as a sub-program under the SMART ministry or SMART ministry, more specifically R, Rhythm or Dance, which became a full-fledged dance group of the church. This group aims to gather the youth that desires to offer their gift of rhythm to the Lord. Here to dance for us, to tribes, God's force, dance ministry.
Once again, let's give the Lord a big, big clap of praise. Amen. Hallelujah. Thank you, G-Force. Thank you, Abba. Hallelujah. Youth Choir, Bulawanon Panon Awit, the Chancel Choir, and the uh, Glorious Harmony Choir. My part here is the most difficult because it says a short reflection. To give a short reflection on a concert is the most difficult one for the pastor is used to preach one hour every sermon. But because the general is here, and we miss you so much, general. Thank you for your presence here. Uh, I will just give three minutes after 20. The scripture says in Romans chapter 12, verse 4 to 6, Paul said, Just as each of us has one body with many members, and these members do not have the same function, so Christ, so in Christ we who are many form one body, and each member belongs to all others. We have different gifts according to the grace given us. If a man's gift is prophesying, let him use it in proportion to his faith. This is the word of the Lord. We can overcome the, tribula the tribulations, the troubles of the world in Christ Jesus. This was the message given to us by Dr. Betty McCann this morning. And let me just add that in a choral group like this and a choral presentation like this, there are so many things that we can learn about overcoming the world. First, Paul said that we can overcome the world because we are one body in Christ. Amen? That means that we live in this world not as a lonely Christian or soldier, but we belong to the one body of Christ. We are not alone. If we are facing trouble and tribulation or even the world, we are facing it together. Now, if we live as one body of Christ, like a choral group, we can overcome the world because each one will play his or her role in the part of the body, just like members of the choir or the choral group. They called it SATB, the sopranos, the altos, the tenor, and the bass. We can overcome the world with Christ, and we can overcome the world because we'll do it together if each one play his role faithfully and well. The most important thing is the word faithfully. Because we know in the choir, I mean, as Paul said, if your gift is singing, let him sing in the choir. And because we are not singing, that is not our gift. That's why if we are forced to sing, some people may not like us. And we know in the Filipino homes or community gatherings, the My Way song is the most dangerous song of all. I did it my way. Sa panahon nga nangahubog na, og di na mo tuo, og tono. Kay ang iya na lang yung pagbuot ang matuman. Yes. But if we are just faithful, in our role as members of the body, as members of the choir, as members of any choral group, we know that practice makes perfect. Tama, di ba? 
Kaya nga, there is practice every time. And that you have to take part regularly with the choral practices. Because only in the practice or practices that we learn our parts. And we learn to appreciate the other parts. And we learn to sing together. Yes, we can overcome the world if we sing together. That's the very character and nature of the choral group. The choral group is only good if everyone and all parts and all voices are in harmony, just like in melody. As the principal would say, you are only as good singer in the choir if you can hear your neighbor. Kung di nakakadungog sa iyang imong tapad, ni sobra na ka. Tama ba na, Pia Piwi? That's why I made my, I tried my best kanina to really hear my neighbors, especially Pastor Frias. Kaya he did the best thing sa bass. Ingun siya, dili unta siya karon kaya naa siya ay party. But thank you, Pastor Frias, for staying for a few minutes just so that we can sing. Kaya ingon me, di yun kumplito kung wala siya. Kaya tag-as kayo may tingog ng mga pastor. Anad good may guwali. Pero only Pastor Frias can harmonize it all because he can give the 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 low tone and the best part, the bass part. Thank you, Pastor Priyas. Thank you all pastors, especially Pastor Melvin, Pastor Grace, joining us sa uh, Il Divino. Sometimes we call it Il Dividendo. Yes. If one, if each one plays its role, his role, we can overcome the world. And especially if we practice it regularly. It is the same in the church. The church is only good if we work together. Especially now that we are facing great problems and crises in the church. You know that. Okay, there is a Crossroads Congregational Church. Gina sermon mampod ng mga problema. Kay, we cannot contain it to ourselves. Especially that we are the mother congregational church here in Mindanao. That means that it's not my problem actually. It's not the problem of the elders or the deacons or the Christian educators, the council. These are all our concern. Whatever happened in the church, in the church institution, is the concern of everyone. Because remember, the Lord came for the church. In fact, when He will come again, He will come for His bride, and the bride is the church of Jesus. Yes, we can make music as our ammunition to fight the troubles and the problems and overcome the world as the progressive song of the uh, uh, what you call playing uh, playing the game song something it says music is my ammunition to fire down Babylon that's a progressive song but in the church it's also true because if we sing together, we can fight the good battle of life. And we can be victorious, overcomers in Christ. Because He is with us, helping us when we sing for Him. When we sing for the Lord, we become stronger and stronger and stronger in our faith. And firm and firmer in our faith. When we sing for the Lord, we know that we become Obedient in His will. When we sing with all our hearts, we know that the Lord will listen. When we sing and declare His praises, even the strongholds of the demons and the Satan 
will crumble before our face because the Lord works in His own mighty way. So we are so blessed, my dear friends, that we are part of this congregation for 120 years, that we are a singing congregation, that we are a praise and worship congregation, and that when we gather, we really join in praising and thanking God for the blessing of this gift of music, that through this we can conquer the world and we proclaim the goodness and the faithfulness of our God Stop, he help establish his kingdom, strengthen the church, and proclaim the good news of Christ's salvation and give glory to his holy name. My dear friends, let us continue to celebrate God's faithfulness in our lives for 120 years. We declare God's faithfulness here in all of our singing and presentations to the glory of God and to the glory of God alone. Happy singing, everyone, and happy joyful journey towards 121. The Lord be with us. Happy anniversary. Happy 120 years. Glory be to the Lord our God. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Pastor Jay, for reminding us that we can overcome by worship, work, and witness in unity as one body in Christ. Faithful in our roles, consistently together. And as we end our first part for tonight, let us welcome Miss Jamie Mangawil to witness how Jesus is always with us. Dreams be. 
Christ Jesus revealed. Jesus Christ we proclaim. His redeeming grace is the story we have to tell. The second part of our anniversary concert brings to life the redemption story of every Christian. Jesus Christ saves. To open our second part, this recently formed group is composed of young men from our various singing groups. To sing Sinner, Saved by Grace, let us welcome the quartet. Just an old sinner saved by grace. I'm just a Victory's God has won. Where would I be? Had God not called me gently to this place? I'm here to say I'm nothing but a sinner.
for reminding us that while we are sinners, we are saved by grace. How wonderful it is that each breath we take is a gift from God, filled with grace from Jesus, who looked beyond our sins and saw our need. The men's choir formally started when Pastor Celso Gallo organized it under the United Churchmen or UCM. They would sing in various concerts thereafter and even went as far as North Sulawesi in Indonesia. This was in 2001. Their conductors included Mr. Rudyard Montaire, Mr. Harold Pedida, Ms. Mahal Oriarte, and now under the direction of Ms. Erika Panotes to sing A Few Good Men. And when we all get together with the Lord, let us welcome the UCM Evangelist, Evangelistic Choir.
Lord. Get together, get together, we the Lord. Well, the weak are the longer afraid of the stronger than they all. Get together, we the Lord. brothers let's do an offertory this was the line that started it what started as an offertory stint turned to a series of opportunities to sing in worship this group from various singing groups and choirs came together to harmonize and blend their voices all for the glory of God to sing on this rock I stand and this could be the day let us welcome the voices in praise
everyone. I'm sure we are all blessed by how the music team offered their gifts and talents for the glory of the Lord. At this point, let me read Exodus 35 verses 4 to 5. It says, Moses said to the whole Israelite community, this is what the Lord has commanded. From what you have, take an offering for the Lord. Everyone who is willing is to bring to the Lord an offering of gold, silver, and bronze. For the 120 years of existence, witness, worship, and work of the church, I think and I believe this is a beautiful invitation for all of us. Let us just bring something, offer for the glory of God. As the choir have offered their gifts in singing, let us also bring our gift of thanksgiving to the Lord. As we witness the CWA dance 
um, in some also offer their gift in dancing. I was glad when they said to me, come to the house of the Lord. Standing here in your gates I was glad when they said to me, come to the house of the Lord, standing here in your gates Jerusalem peace, I don't know. 
God, we offer our lives as we all have witnessed the offering of the gifts and talents. Together tonight is the offering of treasures, O oh Lord, looking forward to how you will use this treasure in the advancement of your banner, of your glory, in the name of Jesus. This is our offering. Amen. Back in May of this year, the Anniversary Committee launched the 120th Anniversary Song Composition Contest with the theme, Overcome, based on John 16, 33. The committee and our music ministry received several entries and what emerged as the winner and thus our 120th Anniversary Song is entitled, Overcomers We Will Be, by our very own Miss Patricia Ann M. Pelayo. We have been singing our anniversary song for the past several Sundays and of course today during our anniversary worship. Now, the other entries are not to be forgotten for they also deserve to, pro to proclaim the word to take heart for Jesus Christ has overcome the world. This third and final part presents original compositions. The first for this part is a newly formed band that played just very recently during the CF Sunday last October 1 with the thought that it will be a one-time thing. Little did they know that this was only the beginning. And thus to cover In Jesus' Name by Darlene Check and sing the original song Victor's Crown by Miss Anne Mangawil Pelayo, everyone, let us welcome your CF band Crossroads.
has overcome, yes, he has overcome. We will not be shaken, we will not be moved. Jesus, you are here. has overcome we will not be shaken we will not be moved jesus you are here he has overcome yes he has overcome we will not be shaken we will not be moved jesus you are here overcome the Lord. Well, that in this world we will have trouble, but in His name we are victorious. In His name, who is fighting for us? God is fighting for us. Pushing out the darkness, fighting up the kingdom that cannot be shaken. In the name of Jesus, enemies that we have, and we will shout it out, shout it out. song. Our second song uh, started as a poem and was inspired by our experience we had during our mission trip to from Manila to Baguio to Sagada to Vigan and to Ilocos Norte where we also had the chance to share the gospel and at the end of the trip had a chance to ride the sand dunes in a 4 by 4 so as the ride began, we did not know what to expect, but it was thrilling, fun, with unexpected turns. Then we would go up again, down again. Then suddenly, um, the driver would just 
go around and we would not know what to expect. Then there would come smooth roads. That reminded me of life. We all face our life roads with challenges, problems, thrills, sadness. Well, in our individual life journey, may the road we travel lead to Jesus, the one who promised to give us peace. We are not alone in this journey, for we know to whom we belong. We belong to the one who overcame the world as he defeated sin and death on the cross in our place. He has won the victory. He is the one who can give us real peace and a sure calm. His name? Jesus. John chapter 16 verse 33 says, Jesus said, I have said this to you that in me you may have peace. In this world you will have tribulation, but take heart, I have overcome the world. May you be blessed with this song entitled, Victor's Crown. Looking at the vast horizon, unexpected steep roads calm, sudden twists, blind curves, sharp turns ahead. Then come the breather, smooth road runs. Enjoy the view while you still can. Life throws of uncertainty, where do they lead you? May they lead you to the one who had traveled life roads to the one who came from heaven above to draw us close to his great love road since road so you can run to a victor's crown then up you go and down again rough road thrills and anxious turns when bumps and swirls don't seem to end, hang in there, friend. For there is someone who cares for you. With wounded hands, he says, take my hand. Life throws up uncertainty, where do they lead you? May they lead you to the one who had traveled life roads to. The one who came from heaven above To draw us close to his great love Broke since road so you can run To a victor's crown Take heart, take heart This world I have overcome Take heart, take heart Come take my hand He says, take heart, take heart this world I have overcome. Take heart, take heart, child, take my hand. Life flows of uncertainty. Where do they lead you? May they lead you to the one who had traveled life's road to. The one who came from heaven above to draw us close to his great love. Broke since road so you can run to a victory. So you can run to a victor's crown. Church, take heart, take heart. This will trust us over. Can we sing? Take heart, take heart. He's holding our hands. Take heart, take heart. This world Christ has overcome. With him, let's run to the victor's crown. Rose of uncertainty, where do they lead you? May they lead you to the one 
who had traveled life roads to the one who came from heaven above to throw us close to his great love broke sin's road so you can run to a victor's crown he broke sin's road so we can run and overcome Thank you very much, Crossroads. Truly, our Christ the Lord broke sin's road so we can run to a victor's crown. What a way to get us back on track. Thank you once again, Crossroads, our CF, and of course, to Teacher Anne. Now, back in the day, there was a clamor for a praise and worship team that can help prepare people's hearts for worship with the modern method of praise. Many musicians in our church have heeded this call over the years and through the generations. In April 2008, a team was born with a mission that the Holy Spirit's passion is to point people to the throne of God, pursuing every possible expression of worship to exalt Him. To sing, You Overcome the World, an original composition by Tommy Veloso, and We Will Overcome, an original composition by Tommy and Sindrel Veloso and Dr. Leslie James Mangawil, we bring you the Echoes of Faith. Good evening. Happy anniversary, everyone. Um, the song that we'll be singing is entitled You Overcome the World. It is, this is uh, personal as it talks about um, personal struggles and then finding the Lord and then accepting Jesus Christ as, our, as my Lord and Savior and then trusting His words that um, whether there are trials and tribulations, He has already overcome the world. So, um, this song is for everyone. In the depths of struggles, I felt so alone. But Jesus, my Savior, he called me his own he walks beside me to every trial and test with his strength and love i know i know i know i'm truly blessed in the midst of challenge i find his embrace the holy spirit's presence a comforting grace He fills me with courage When I feel weak Enabling me to stand To rise, proclaim, to speak Through His death and resurrection Hope was brought to birth The chain of sin was shattered I praise you, Almighty Redeemer, the Lamb of God. To you I surrender all of my heart, all of my soul. Jesus, my Lord and Savior, I trust you, Almighty Protector. Your life may bring all the burden and pain. I will take heart when you have overcome the world. Hope was brought 
to burn. The chain of sin was shattered. He has overcome the world. Jesus, our Lord and Savior, I praise you, Almighty Redeemer, the Lamb of God. To you I surrender all of my heart, all of my soul. Jesus, my Lord and Savior, I trust you, Almighty Protector, your life may bring all the burden and pain. I will take heart when you have overcome the world. I bear witness of his grace in every moment, every place. I find victory anew. His peace and love forever through. I bear witness of His grace through every moment, every place. I find victory anew. His peace and love forever true. I bear witness of His grace in every moment, every place. I find victory anew. Yeah. 
marches won with banners raised proclaiming hope and singing praise no obstacle is too great to face with brother strength we will win the echoes of faith, it is truly an assurance that we need not fear, for Jesus has overcome the world. Such beautiful music it calls us to share with everyone, even beyond our own church. Great is our God indeed. Now the youth ministry is a big ministry that helps mold and prepare our young people for their discipleship journey. Our youth has regular fellowship on Fridays that they call It's Free Day. This fellowship is filled with the nurturing and feeding of the Holy Spirit through the study and meditation of the Word and praise and worship through music. To sing Overcome, an original composition by Miss Elaine Joy A.J. Atavelo and Nabuntog, composed by Earl Jose Magana and Emmanuel John Mahipos, help us welcome the Freedom Music Team with the Pilgrims Youth Choir. This is a write-up about the song of the composer, Ate Alain Joy Atabello. So this song was inspired by God as I and Kuya Enrico talked about the plan of doing a ukulele worship for the youth. Right after we talked about it, the Lord allowed me to write the song in accordance to His words for the church in the last days or during the end times. As we face current situations, not only in UCCP, but as a holistic body of Christ, we hold on to the promise of the Lord that we overcome because He already has overcome the world.
This is a write-up by, by the composer Earl Jose Magana. The song Nabuntog Overcome in English is a declaration song which tells uh, the story of how one can overcome his challenges in life and rise victorious from these challenges because God has already overcome the world. Nabuntog is written in the Visayan dialect to touch the hearts of the Dab Dabawenyo congregation who is the very heart of um, of UCCP Crossroads Congregational Church. Nabuntog is not only a song but also a reminder that even if the world is heavy, God is moving forward with us.
Thank you, everyone, and thank you for tonight. And before we close, we'd like to acknowledge again each group who gave their hearts and their passion through the music that was from tonight. Let us start with the first group, the Bulawanong Pananawit. As we call you, please uh, come forward so that we can recognize. Once again, the Bulawanong Pananawi. Thank you. Next up, may we call on our chancel choir. Thank you to our chancel choir and next may we call on the glorious harmony choir
once again our glorious harmony choir thank you next up we would like to call on the tribes dance troupe i'm sorry the g force dance ministry G-Force Dance Ministry, we would like to call on our soloist, Miss Jamie Sophia Mangawin, along with our choir tech, so that we can also have a picture together. Quartet, who are mostly already there, come forward please for uh, a quick photo. would like to call on the UCM Evangelistic Choir.
Thank you to our voices in praise. We'd like to call on the echoes of faith.
Enrico. And Mr. Enrico as okay, well. Enrico. Uh, Mr. Enrico Agana. What's the name? Sebastian. Brothers, sisters, ladies and gentlemen, the music ministry of the United Church of Christ in the wow. Philippines. Congregational Church. The Four Square. At the crossroads. Let's all stand. Uh, finally, before the closing prayer, I uh, would like to continue to thank God for our council chair, Ati Susan. Susan ba yes, and the anniversary committee uh, chairperson, Ma'am Dine. Palapakan po natin ang Panginoon. Thank you for your life. Thank you for serving the Lord. Let us pray. God of yesterday, the present, and the future, indeed, Lord, you are great and marvelous into our lives, in the life of the world, in the life of the church, even, Lord, the humble congregation here, of UCCP Crossroads Con Congregational Church, for your sustaining grace and power for 120 years, Lord, of preaching, teaching, and healing. And for more years to come before you return, Lord, that we will be found faithful, doing and obeying your will and purpose for our existence. And thank you, Lord, that all that we have offered to you, this worship, activities, the program ministries, the singing and the praises, Lord, tonight. All of this we commit to you for your glory, honor, and praise alone and that your church will be strengthened as we minister to one another and minister to your name. Thank you, Lord, for inspiring us and encouraging us, Lord, to pursue the mission work started by those who have gone ahead. And that we, Lord, will be empowered by the Holy Spirit even more to continue, Lord, doing your task until you come. Lord, thank you that you are honored in our lives and that your people, Lord God, are ready even to continue to serve in your name to the whole world and to the communities. And now may the grace of our Lord Jesus, the love of the Father, the communion, the joy, the power of the Holy Spirit rest and abide with us now and always. Amen and amen.
take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Jesus says, take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. This world I've overcome. In this world we'll have tribulations. In this world we'll have troubles of our own. When sorrow and hurting fill your soul. Look to the one who's been through it all. Take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Jesus says, take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. This world I've overcome. He gave us his spirit oh so strong. An armor and a book of hope and song. Forces of darkness do abound. Church, be steadfast, free, stand your ground. Take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Jesus says, Take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. This world I've overcome. So on earth, let's journey on in faith. Resisting sin, enduring the race. Don't lose heart, though hard pressed we may be. For God is strong and He's in you and me. Take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. I have overcome. Jesus says, Take heart. I have overcome. Take heart, take heart. This world I've overcome. True to Jesus, our Savior, Lord, and friend, each one ardent till the very end, shining bright for him the world to see, more than conquerors through him who set us free. Take heart, take heart, we will overcome, take heart, take heart, we will overcome more than conquerors through him who set us free. Be steadfast, free stand your ground. 